Hey guys, welcome back to Railroads Online. Um, right, so this is a map. Really, you say it is? Yes, it's Railroads uh, Studio. It's a website, so you can load your save and have a look at what you've done. You can even edit things if you want to. We're using it to have a quick look at what we built a couple of episodes ago. We've got the sawmill down this end. We go around. Once again, it goes around. So what I'm looking at here is maybe we have another turning here so we can actually get all the way around. We do need a couple more uh, sidings probably. Now the bit I really was looking at is, uh, well, the bridge we made. Because I do know at this end we're going to have to make some changes. But I was wondering why we're having so many difficulties uh, getting up this first bit. And well, uh, if I go in so you can probably see it. Most of this is 1.5. You can see it's just 1.5, 1.5, 1.5. And then we get to 2.8. 2.4 so yeah a bit more <laughs> but then we go to 1 here so if we were to go to maybe 1.5 here then we've got 0.5 here as well 1.7 we're going to 1.5 maybe we'll go a little bit higher and we don't have to do this possibly we can go a bit further as well I was wondering whether we could go out to the mountain itself and that maybe that would look a bit better we didn't have to have so much of a bridge and we can actually come down with that so yeah, that's that's project, maybe online, maybe offline, not sure. But today what we are going to be dealing with is up here. The bulk of the episode, what I want to do, is reach the smelter. But we can't just go from here up to here. There's a sheer cliff. You can see these white bits here. But what I'm thinking is that we're going to move this bridge to this point. Well, there's two options, basically. We can either keep it as it is and have some sort of turning come in here and then we're going to have to go back across and up so I don't think I think the only way of getting up here onto this ledge here and then finally up to here is to come from here and start to incline quite dramatically from here you can't there's no chance of doing it from here um, the Shea engine's probably going to live up here because I think probably we can't do 1.5 here I think it's going to be at least 2 to 2.5 and as we can see we have problems down here going that high. All right, should we actually uh, go and load the map up and uh, well, we can have a proper look? Right, so here we are taking a bird's eye view of everything around this area. Um, I think eventually we're going to move this bridge further down here, keep going down. Then we'll take a slightly sharper route round and try and head to that mountain there. And then we'll get, try and get down further. So hopefully by this point we can actually then be mu pretty much on the ground. The other thing I've noticed now is this route down here, we need to be able to get onto this without having to go into there. So today, because we haven't got that, we need to take some wagons up to the top. We're going to get them in a second, which means we're going to have to shunt them up there, because we've only got wagons here. We've got no, again, we have no means to actually uh, move these out of the way. We head across this way. Because we need to think how we're going to build this last bit. Look at the look at the height of these ridges here. See, we have got to get up. First of all, up to this one, this plateau here. Then we have to get up to the next one, where the industry is, where the smelter is. So realistically, we are coming off there again, going back this way, along this plateau, coming back, and then up here. It's, an, it's going to be an interesting build. Wow, well, should we stop talking about actually dirt then, I suppose? Step one, we're going to go and get some wagons. Right, so what are we going to buy? Um, we've got a choice. That one or that one? Oh, this one's cheaper. I've got 3,000. I can buy three. I do prefer the look of these. Again. One there, one there. What's there? Right. Maybe I should have moved the engine before I did this. I think we cheat this one across to here and then we'll do them properly. I'm gonna kind of okay, gonna come and do this bit anyway. Yeah. 
this is going to take an awful long time. Yep. into the other one, their brakes are still on, don't forget to take the brakes off. No, no, you might put the brake on. So what we go. It's going to take a long time. I will edit bits of this out. The black plume up there. Almost five minutes later and we're just making this turn. We can see the wonderful bridge. It's functional. You see what I mean about the bridge? Maybe we could actually can bring it out a bit more and it, we can hit this land. And if we take it down a bit further down here as well. Oh, can we actually make this turn? Yes, yeah, quite easily. Actually, it's quite sharp though, isn't it? Right, so we're going to go right here. Other engines down there. Then we're going to do the switch back and come back up here again. Oh, actually, uh, I can break now, actually. We finally made it here. It's part of me says, let's fill this up and take that as well, but I don't think we're going to do that. There's not a lot of space out there right now. So I've done that. Put that off. I don't really foresee any problems us going up here. I do wish we could pull out more on the camera. Let's have some better shots then, rather than just this. Uh, the oil fields again. 
Can go down that way. There they are. Was that the oil refinery? I can't remember. It's one or the other. Yeah, as expected, this engine has no problem getting up here, does it? I know it's not... It's got one less wagon than the other one. It's not got any... Uh, anything in it. But it was fa fairly expected. Slowly, slowly. Okay, right, if you don't enter the train and press V... That's better. Better screenshots. Well, we're nearly there. <laughs> I say that's because they're going to take us a good five minutes. So we might, might do then. Yeah, we talked about that a few times. Go round left more and come back round. And get rid of this bit of the bridge. But uh, we will see. I'm not sure. But what you can see very well here is those shelves. We've got these plateaus on in front of us. So on the next bit, we need to get onto that lower plateau, just the hill above us, and then we have to get onto the top one as well. So I just think we're going to have to build another long bridge, slowly going up, and then take a, a turn back round again. But we'll work it out. We always do. Finally see the mine, up onto the shelf. You haven't been up here since I built it. Yeah, I've done the runaround. Again, where that stays, I'm not entirely sure right now. I forgot I wasn't on this view. It's the most not not the most elegant runaround. Don't worry. There's nobody come to mess, which is nice, isn't it? Yes, this is what I was... I, originally, I was hoping we'd be able to go back round and then kind of continue. Sort of up there. I did do a few test sort of runs here, but we get about halfway up here. It's... not going to be doable. So it looks to me like... If we were to come from here, we're going to have to go back around here. And if we, if we are taking this, using this one as to go downwards, we're going to have to take a well, quite a sharp stay on this ledge here. We don't want to go up the hill at all. And the more I look at this, the more we're going to be at the wrong angle. Although saying that, we would be here, wouldn't we? But the other thought is that in order to get up there, we'll probably have to come from this side. And at the very, very least, we're going to have to put some points in around here so we can start making our ascent up. So the other idea was that we come off here and go up here, here. So we can then go round, keep the height, go above here, and then we're already up. Or we do a hybrid of the two. So, this, we replace this bit of bridge here with the bit we just talked about going down that way and meet it up around there. 
this bit of track we completely take out. We go up further, try and gain some height, come back round, and we want a bridge around here, ready to go up. I think we're going to try something. We're up on the ledge, obviously. We'll put a bit of track here. We'll put it down there. I've just cleared some trees. And we'll see how far we can go about two degrees going down. Yeah, that doesn't work. We can physically see without going any further. That's not going to work. Okay, let's try from here then. No, I don't want to take it that much. 2.5. And certainly this one can't do it, but it's just a proof of concept, right? Where we can go from, where we can actually get down to that height. So essentially we're going that way. I'm trying to go this way just to lengthen it and lose height. We have to go to the bridge now, don't we? Now, I'm not expecting this to work, by the way. I'm expecting this to be ripped out. Right, we're now too far in, so... Yeah, we are. So I, I think at two, deg two degrees, we're still... We'll carry on for a second, but I don't think this is going to work. Just 2.5, not 2, isn't it? 2.5 again. Very interesting, we are going to hit the uh, hill. I think we're still too high. Yes, we are that much higher. Hmm. Right, well, I've been pondering this. Well, I've just had some lunch. I've just been pondering this for the last 10 minutes. I think we have to come in to the bottom from that side. And I think we have to take this bit of track out. And I think we have to somehow get up there. Well, it's done now. I suppose we might be able to make it like that. Might be able to do it too. I don't like going up too much. I'm trying my best not to. So we're only actually a little bit lower than we were there. Now the observant of you might notice one little eensy wincy problem with our idea. That that's going in that angle, we are still at this angle, and I don't think we can actually make it, can we? Uh, yeah, that means we're going to have to look at a lot, not steeper, what's the word? Um, the degree is going to have to be a lot more here. Make 
Sledge. So we're trying to lengthen it, aren't we? Yeah, it's slightly annoying that we have to rebuild this bridge here. Okay, I think we should actually build a little bit of that bridge now. Really just a starting off point. Now we need to see if we can connect over there. And I think that's going to be difficult. No. So we need to angle it more. Can do it with that. Well, it's not getting onto the land which I would like to go onto, but you know, not as bad as it was before. The bridge is going from that direction. Still a massive bridge, but at least it's less of a less height than that one. connection than it was before, I think. And once again, you probably could go further over, make a less of an arc, well, more of an arc around here. Well, got to go with these trees. One day they'll grow and we'll be derailed. Deleting the bridge, and I have got rid of uh, all the trees underneath that bridge. I think this this feels like a worse way in, but I can do about it. Good enough. I 
I'm betting there's more of these little blighters about. Don't like this idea, 2.5. I also don't think we're going to be getting over that track otherwise. How big is this? Very big. And we're still not doing it. Okay, are we high enough at least? Go over that ridge. Just. Hmm. I don't know if that's high enough either. Oh. I don't think that's high enough. Well, there is clearance. Not a lot of it, but there is clearance. I still think we probably have to take this out and do 2.5 further over. And we're going to have to hide this somewhere as well. At some point. What go is this? Going a little bit further might do it. We're very close to the drop. I don't think we're at the drop though. Let's try the bridge from here. I, I think it, I don't think it's long enough. You are just. Oh, look at that. We're much closer to it now. Doesn't mean I like the 2.5, but that looks far higher. See the rails at least. Oh, we got to get out that ridge yet, and this has taken a long time. And that's where we're going to leave it today. We're going to continue this on the next episode. Um, it's a very long build, so uh, well. If you want to see how it goes you better continue watching thank you very much for watching if you enjoyed it please press the like button if you want to see more please subscribe and press that ding dong bell when you know what it does see you next time bye z bye <laughs>